Yeah. Where are you at, Ben? What do you mean, where am I? You, I, I thought you weren't allowed around high schools and No, that's Ammon. Schools. Oh, that's <laughs> Ammon. <laughs> So we're at the uh, Grain Valley High School graduation day. No, graduation's already happened, right? Yeah, that was two weeks ago. So today is uh, last, last day, day of school. school. For the lower classmen. Yeah. For lower classmen? And what are we doing at the school? Well, the boys have decided to... We, we heard a rumor. Come take a look. And apparently it's true. The cops have uh, all lined up ready to nail these guys. We've got a cop over here. We've got a cop over here. Got two cops over there. Anyway, today was the uh, quad, quad and dirt bike day. Is that the, is that the That's moped the that was in the ditch? No, no, no. I don't know. I don't even know who rode that here. I just got a text. They were like, I rode the moped. Yep, so Caden and Braden decided to spiff theirs all up. Oh, that's that's glossy and pretty. Yep, and they all came to my house, and while I was in Platte City getting DEF out of my diesel tank, they used all my detailing. Yeah, so Braden got a nice little text last night from his dad. Yeah. His dad put DEF in the diesel tank, and we had to drain two tanks worth of diesel. You know, they make they the make system. a tank just for that. Stuff. You know, I tried telling my dad. I think he dad, was a little pissed off about that one. I tried telling my dad, but he just wouldn't listen. <laughs> so you got Ryan's yep. 450, you got Braden's 400, Caden's 400, um, and then... I think what you should do is you should get on that and ride wheelies up and down over there in front of those two and see what happens. There's the... Is that the boys a, is are back that a dare? Town. <laughs> oh, here they come. So the boys all brought their helmets and walked around school with their helmets today. This is Caden's yeah. dad, by the way. He's oh, this is Caden's dad? Oh. What's up, guys? Yeah. I rode at your house I rode at your house before. Okay. Right on. <laughs> you guys have some fans here in these white cars. Uh, yeah, have you seen? We have a lot of fans. <laughs> good, good, man. You all good being on YouTube? Yeah. All right. So, so are, you the, are you the principal, vice principal? Yeah. Assistant principal. Assistant yeah. principal? Okay. So the assistant principal has hooked these boys up. Going to let them. Front row parking. I know. That's nice. This is sick. Yeah. Pretty cool last day. Parade in, parade out. Oh, that's cops, good. cops are all good with it. They're all, they're all gravy. <laughs> so. What's up, man? Doing good. How you doing? You got your helmet too, right? Yep. He's sweet. Safe, being safe. Safe. You really brought the channel. Oh heck yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah, we got all these parents <laughs> picking up their kids. Huh? Hey, they said that as long as we don't do anything stupid, they won't. Yeah, I know. I saw that. <laughs> yes, I was. You ready for tonight? We're gonna be safe. Come on, Jackson. We even have a moped. I like it. Jackson! I got the newest bike here. <laughs> so the assistant principal's in on it. He told them to line yeah, up. Cool. Yeah, we got, it. So. We got the okay for the school and the PD as long as we're not doing anything super dumb. The, the problem is, I know the three of you intimately. You more than others. Because uh, you take your clothes off around me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, that was your fault? <laughs> the fact that you say you're not going to be dumb is uh, You know me. <laughs> you know I won't be dumb. It's yeah, I'm scared of it. All right, any big plans for the summer? Uh, well, we're kicking the weekend on right, going to the lake right after Going this. to the lake? Okay. I'll probably just be in your house all summer. I've heard all about you. Really? Yeah. No way. Oh, yeah. You might be as much trouble as I am. Wow. Oh, it's all right, smoke show. <laughs> Got administrators driving around oh, everywhere, man. parents checking out all these kids. This is pretty cool. Got the GoPro.
Grand Valley, Missouri, 2023. You know, I would have done this, but I wouldn't have asked the principal. I wouldn't have talked right. to the police. I wouldn't have done any of that. Yeah, we would have just done it. Oh, is he? Rolled start? Yeah, awesome. well, There's always one guy that needs a roll start. My bike's being weak. on my hand, but that's okay. <laughs> That's cool that they didn't go after him. Yeah. They're just having fun for one day. Just <laughs> just let them do their thing. That's, That's pretty cool when cops can let kids be kids for a little bit. Yeah. I mean, they'll get them later. That's true. As soon as they, they get home and they them. leave again, they're going to nail them. I'm sure I'm going to be getting a phone call. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So it is Friday. What is it? May 26th or something? 26th. It's the last day of school for Brain Valley. Last day of school. So why are we at the school? You know, the boys, we support a lot of things that go on at the school, and we caught wind that there was an event, and we weren't invited. Uh, being a dad of one of these boys, I figured we better come get some video of this. So they, they thought it would be cool on the last day to ride their ATVs and stuff to school. ATVs, dirt bikes, scooters. There was even a scooter. <laughs> <laughs> he couldn't pop wheelies. <laughs> but they all rode them, and... Uh, we came down to see what the big hoopla was about. Yep, got it on video. That's pretty cool, because uh, that's only a one day event, right? Yep, yep, they won't be doing it tomorrow. Nope. <laughs> Everybody will be at the lake tomorrow. Hopefully. Hey, we even have a side-by-side -side over here. Well, those are legal. We got teachers out here waving to everybody, saying goodbye. Hopefully we don't see you again soon. <laughs> Anyway, it was pretty cool to see these guys do it. That's something we would have done, and I'm not going to lie, we did it with tractors and other things. Yeah. <laughs> so I thought it was really cool that the police helped. Like, they didn't get mad. They, like, let them out. Let them do their thing. It's yeah, good. that was pretty, kids pretty cool of the local PD to do that for them. So. Anyway, I guess we're going to leave now. Hopefully we don't get pulled over. Well, I'm only allowed around schools for about 10 minutes. <laughs> I have to stay 250 feet away. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> anyway, all right. Thanks for tuning in, guys. We'll it's see pest you on control, the next guys. One. We've got a million other things to do to prep. We were just talking about trailers and logistics and all the fun stuff that nobody wants to deal with, but. I think we've got it all figured out. We just have to, uh, guess we have to buy a trailer. We haven't really said much on our channel, but somebody came in the middle of the night and stole our trailer. That, that trailer has been a good piece of our business for many years. It's super... And it had 12 ply tires on it, dang it. <laughs> and Ryan's really <laughs> upset about the tires. <laughs> I'm upset because we don't have a trailer. So this is the trailer that's featured in a bunch of our videos, picking up trucks. My truck rode on it when the when the turbo went out. We just the problem is we didn't have insurance on that, and it, it got yanked. It's done. It's gone. We didn't have the trackers on it either. No, so we got trackers on them now. We do now. But anyway, shame on you, thieves, <laughs> for stealing a trailer. You're naughty. Because it's making our life difficult to try to get the uh, skis all put together. But we'll work it out. We're... So I, I left for three days. Well, four, does, technically. Does crap usually hit the fan when you or I are out of town? Yes. <laughs> all the time. So I get back Monday morning, come in, see the guys. And I'm like, oh, the uh, trailer 
Ryan must have come and got it. Didn't think anything of it. And then the next day I said something to Chance because it was still not back. I'm like, did Ryan take the trailer? And he's like, yeah, I think so. I did not take the trailer. He didn't but... know when. <laughs> so Wednesday morning, I, I roll into the office and I go upstairs and Ryan has lost <laughs> all the keys to the trailer several times. N numerous times, yeah. So we, we're down to one set on the locks. There's two locks on the trailer, one set, there's two keys and he puts them, we put them in my box outside of my In case office. anybody wants to borrow it yeah. anytime. So I look. And I'm talking about you guys. <laughs> I look and the keys are in the box and I'm like, well, why would he bring the keys back up? I got curious and I started checking our surveillance cameras and it was not there. It was there Friday night. It was not there when the guys came in Saturday. So I started going through and uh, 3.30 in the morning, uh, an unknown white truck comes in and Dooley. Ho hooks up to the trailer, cuts the locks off and takes off. He was there about 12 minutes, 11 minutes. It took like him that. that long to do it? Well, he, he had to back up like six times. <laughs> so he's not, he's not too versed on... Uh... The locks, he got off like that, but he couldn't back up. Oh, what an idiot. So somebody stole our trailer. Um, we are going to the police station here. Uh, they asked for our surveillance camera footage on a thumb drive. Who even uses thumb drives anymore? Uh, the Grand Valley Police Department. <laughs> That's who. So I've got it. We're going to drop this off. And then we may do some investigating of our own. Interestingly enough, I got a phone call the next day from the police department. I think it was dispatch or somebody saying, hey, Kansas City Police think that they may have located your trailer. And I'm like, oh, great. Uh, I get need, my tires back. You need to, yeah, you need to call them. And uh, this is the officer's name, his number. And I called him and I said, hey, this is Ben. We had our trailer stolen. Um, I was told to, to touch base with you guys. And uh, I don't know if he thought that I was with the Green Valley Police. He I'm had not to, sure. Because he gave you a lot of information. He gave me names. He gave Addresses. me address of where they're sitting told me what they're doing as far as surveillance and what their plan is but they gave us the address we may go take a peek we have a drone we have a drone so we don't have to get too close we can fly over there and see because we'll know if it's our trailer it's got some distinct features so we're, we're gonna go do some investigating work since it's Friday and Ryan's up early I got done with my paver project yesterday so I can actually go play so we're gonna see what we can come up with we may we may end up with nothing bullet holes in our truck i hope not i wonder if they're still casing the place out if the police are still we roll up there and the police are there and we put a drone in the air we're gonna find out pretty quick <laughs> <laughs> all right so we're parked at the auto zone literally across the street <laughs> from the address there's no there's nothing there but i'm gonna put the bird up and just oh it's freaking raining I see her rolling up over black Cadillac, high heel boots, and a sexy body full of tats. Baby's bad, oh baby's hella bad. After her, there. All right, Ryan went in to buy some Mexican candy at this uh, store in Little Mexico. Trailer search was a bust. You know, you have to go do things, otherwise you're like, I should have gone and done it. You never know what happens until you do it. So, we had to come and look. I flew the drone over. There's an empty lot. Well, not an empty lot. There's a lot next door that has a privacy fence. And I'm like, it could be in there. But there was actually nothing in there. So if you're in Kansas City and you see a, uh, I'll put the picture of the truck on here. If you see it, it's a probably like a 99 or 2000 F350 uh, dually with a flatbed. Got toolboxes on the side. It's an extended cab, not four door. It's an extended cab with the little suicide doors. White, I believe. It's light in color. But uh, if you see it, if you see one like it, drop a comment or send us an email. We'd like to uh, have it checked out. So it's unfortunate that people are thieves. Got this black van next to us. It's a it's a Hispanic eater. 
I swear, like 15 people have gone and gotten into it. Here comes another one. They just... They just come over, climb in, and it eats them, and it doesn't leave. I don't know what's going on. Ryan doesn't go anywhere near that van. They don't ever... Yeah. Have you ever seen a can with a wrap? Yes. Yeah. Dude, I got... Booba Luba. What the frick is Booba Luba? I don't know. It looks Boo -boo good. Booba Lubu. And then... Some Crema... By Color. Cremino... By Color. But everybody sure. was in there getting food from the food place like real like authentic food i was wondering if i should have done that probably oh well well you didn't get killed while i was in there no i locked the doors because i feared for my life <laughs> i really did see look there's another oh, one another one he's looking at the van and now he's going to get in it and get eaten from indiana the van's from indiana so he hands me this mexican energy bar protein bar <laughs> <laughs> it's not. It's a boo boo loo boo. And supposedly it's chocolate. It does not taste like chocolate. It tastes like. <laughs> oh, 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 that's bad. The marshmallow is not bad. It, it's got marshmallow. The raspberry or whatever it is in the middle is not bad. It's. Uh, but that chocolate is rough. Oh, yeah, man. It's, it's interesting. Boo boo loo boo. You really need, you really need some candy, a candy fix if you're going to eat these. A gallon of milk, too, jeez. I spent 12 bucks on it. What, did, what a ding dong. You've got all sorts of cop cars and everything up here. Well, this is life. Both in, ways. Life in Kansas City. If it sprinkles for five minutes, it becomes dangerous. Hey, there's some stuff in the road. Oh, yeah, look at this. Oh, somebody lost a chalk and a cone. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Somebody got a boo boo. That means a somebody boo -boo. got hurt. Somebody got the boo boos. So we came through as the police were going. Now we've got emergency medical coming through. How is MoDOT here with their motors to assist before the cops and the EMS? I don't know. Here we go, we're gonna get a look at it. One, two, three, cars, four, four. Oh dear. My back. Motorcycles. Oh, motorcycles. Oh, there were two motorcycles parked there. That's never good, that doesn't work out for the motorcycler. Look how much the KDX is leaking. Is that? Who's is that? Uh, this kid in Colton's. I don't, I don't know where to stick the camera. Well, you don't stick it. I don't know what to do shine. with my hands. <laughs> Some of you know I was on vacation for a few days. Hold on, let me put my seatbelt on. Uh, yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna <laughs> give us crap for that. And, and the biggest kick in my balls for this one is the fact that I had some really nice 12 ply tires on that. <laughs> I'm not worried about the trailer, I'm worried about the tires. You might have a little help under my seat. There's a famous song about it. It was two idiots out with drones and cameras. And two idiots? <laughs> I'd say you're only half. <laughs> oh, he's, he's dying over here. Okay, we'll update you in a bit. Kind of depressing that people actually live like this. Like what? 
Just like, to eat Mexican food? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> That's my butt would be on fire every day. <laughs> Shoot. It's tart. It's good though. It's not good though. I don't I, know. I'm so confused. Mexican chocolate. Maybe it's just this brand. I don't know. But I'm not a fan <laughs> of the chocolate itself. Yeah. Anyway, oh. that was fun. Thanks for sharing. We're done. <laughs> Apparently, the rest of the people that live here. I'm pretty sure the shelves are bare right now from the <laughs> bread. Because <laughs> it sprinkled for five minutes. <laughs> but there's a little city going on over there. Don't do drugs. <laughs> Which brings me to my next point. <laughs> Don't, Don't do drugs. drugs. Mm.